hey, happy Thanksgiving. Well, tomorrow. But today, I'm cooking already. How about you? <laughs> I like to prepare as much as I can the day before, so I don't have to do so much on the day of. So check out my stuffing. I am making stuffing, of course, without any bread. So I am sauteing my veggies. I've got onions, I've got celery, I have mushrooms and garlic happening right now. And I chopped up some fresh herbs, a mixture of thyme and sage and rosemary. And of course, some fruit. It's always fun. Some dried apricots and sun-dried tomatoes. I'll chop up some nuts. Let's see, we've got almonds, pecans, and walnuts in there. Put a sweet Italian sausage. <laughs> it's hard to do this one-handed. <laughs> Take the casing off. I'm going to chop it up with my spatula. Add a little bit of red pepper flakes to the sweet sausage just to make it. You know, give it a little kick so you remember it when you bite into it. How's that? <laughs> also going to add some apple. I already did the dried apricot and sundry tomato, but there's nothing like the apple. And I put it in there raw, and so when it cooks in the oven, it'll still have a little bit of texture to it when you eat it. I add those herbs to the veggies. Mmm, it's smelling so good. <laughs> so don't tell anyone, but I'm going to share with you my secret ingredient for my stuffing. Okay, I mean, I already shared some, but this is super secret. So my secret ingredient comes from here. <laughs> And this happens to be leftovers. I've got cauliflower rice and some grated carrots and old a yam and some bacon. That's secret ingredient this year. Then I add a little bit of like almond flour and some whipped up egg and mix that together. And then I'm just gonna put this thing in the oven when it's time, you know, before. I'm gonna put it in the oven for like probably 45 minutes to an hour. 